Hello and welcome to Bread of Life, a daily devotional program which each week features a different area pastor. Our speaker for this week is Pastor Ellis Stanley of Bridgeport. Hi, this is Minister Ellis Stanley Sr. at the Church of Christ in Bridgeport. Welcome to our Day 6 Devo on Everybody Needs a Savior. We are so happy that we're able to share just a few minutes with you to get you started. Uh, Devos are very important um, because they they help us with our day and jumpstart our day. So that's what I want to do for you. I just want to give you a few minutes to get you up, get you moving, and get you fresh and refresh and just start you out with your day because that's what we need. We need that booster shot. We need to get that energy level up. You know, as we hit the coffee pot, the tea, you know, no hot chocolate and all the things that we have to do, a couple of, you know, bagels or whatever it is that we do for the physical body, we need something for the spiritual body. So, you know, just think about that. Everybody needs a Savior, and Jesus is that Savior. From the beginning of time, before time was time, on this side of humanity, God knew that if he made us in his own image, what would happen? we would decide to rebel. He wouldn't be enough. So because of love, and that's the image side of God, which is love, we weren't going to understand that. Adam and Eve didn't understand that. Because first thing about love is to be obedient. When someone says something to you or instruct you to do something, you do it out of love because you're hearing it and you're hearing it in love, especially when that person has done everything for you. So that's God. God is a father. So God wants us to act like children. He wants us to act like he's the father because he does father things. He, He's in the father business. So when he asks us to do something, it's always based on what he already did. See, and that's the, the one thing that humanity doesn't understand, that God has already done things for us, so everybody needs a savior. So with the rebellion came sin, and with sin came separation. And guess what? God knew that was going to happen. So what did he do? He sent his son. Okay, so now now you're in there. You're doing your prayer. You got all that out of the way. You're ready now to shine your light. So whichever way he have you go when you come out of that bathroom, that's what you got to do now with energy. Got to get your energy level up. You know your light. You know you got to shine. We've been talking about that, so you know that that's what I have to do first thing in the morning. So I have to realize that I have to be all that God wants me to be no matter what that is, because I don't know what the day is going to be like. So in faith, I'm going to do what God asked me to do. No matter who I run into, I'm going to do what God asked me to do. And I'm going to have a great time. I'll feel good about it because everybody needs a Savior. And I have him as my Savior, and I want the whole world to know it. So as I go through these things, God is going to take care of me, and I'm going to take care of his business. I'm going to be serious about his business. And I'm going to bless people as he blessed me. And people are going to see it. They're going to feel it because they're going to start developing a relationship with me. And most of the time, they're going to hear from me. They're going to want to see me because they know that I got that energy level. I always got something positive to say. You see? And that's what he's going to do through me because I'm in his kingdom and I'm doing his business. So think about that. Think about getting ready getting on board, and getting the news out there. Think about that. Because you know everybody needs a Savior because you have him as your Savior. So everybody else needs one. Praise and blessings. You've been listening to Pastor Ellis Stanley of Bridgeport, and this has been Bread of Life, a program to encourage you from God's Word.